Welcome to Omron's Quick Tip Videos. Today I'll be showing you how to backup and restore for the NX1P controller using SysMac Studio. The hardware that I have is NX1P, a 1S servo, an EtherCAT slave with some NXIO. Here is a list of the hardware that I'm using. I've created a project in SysMac Studio I'm showing you here that I'm online with the controller, IP address 192.168.250.1, and in my project I have a couple of EtherCAT nodes. I have the 1S servo, and I also have the EtherCAT coupler with some NXIO on there as well. I've created my program and tested it and downloaded, and now I'm ready to back up my program. I'll go to Tools, Backup, Backup Controller, and I'll point to the location that I want to store this. And I've created a folder on my C drive called NX1P, and then created a subfolder Backup Restore 1S with NX. I click OK, and I click Execute. and the backup processing is done. I click yes. And we can see down here the comparison results of our controller backup. The program matches, Ethercat slaves match, NX units on the CPU rack match as well. At this point I'm going to clear the memory of my PLC program and controller. I'm still online. I've gone to program mode and I'll clear all memory. And this will clear the user program and variables, network settings, etc. And all done. I've created a new project in SysMac Studio. And now I've got a blank slate. So there's nothing in here and I will go online with the controller and it says CPU has no name and I'm gonna go to tools restore controller and I'll point to my backup files and then execute and I get a little notification cycle power to the slaves to apply the settings so I'll click OK I've cycled power and now I'm going to come over and I'm going to upload from controller remember previously I cleared out the memory on my controller And I am successful there and I'll open up my EtherCAT and I can see my two nodes and I'll open up my slave terminal configuration and I see all my NXIO and I look at my programs and they are there as well and that is how to do a backup restore for the NX1P